Shook to Imanaga ready to work with Miguel Amaya. And a fastball misses and we are underway. Twins lineup is in lead. In the air, center field, Pete Crow Armstrong. And out number one. The wind appears to be blowing in Joe Girardi. I think 19 miles an hour with that wind. And the first one to Carlos Santana is scoreboard knocks down a little bit. Check swing went too far. It's a strike. Joe Girardi. Just a thought. I know. Swing and a miss. He is leading the league in pants to sock ratio, but down on strikes there. Care where the pants were. He chased a split down for strike two and then chased a four seamer up for strike. Swing and a miss at a pitch upstairs. And but it's only the first time he's done it. Two, two starts in a row. Yep. And he. Here's the 0 2. And that's too high. And I learned something. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Even Naga able to get Lewis. Three up, three down. Pitch in for a strike to Isak. Fast. Paredes fires. Yeah, and you can. I think he's going to be a really good player. Followed by the Yankees, Jose Trevino. That is drilled. Left field. Margot is back and it's gone into the basket. First home run as a cub for Isak Paredes. That's got to feel great and it is 3 nothing as the Cubs do it with two outs. Luke, I was telling you earlier about I used to look at the wind every day and when it was howling in, I wanted to know who had the most hitters that could cut the wind. Well, the Cubs have one, and I know it's Paredes. He gets this fastball, and it's not high enough. He has been so good with this fastball lately, but this one, he gets down thigh high. Paredes really puts a charge into it, and it barely gets out of here. As well, so Sam is a fan photographer. She's oh, she's always there with her positive attitude, supporting the players, us, everyone. He arrived with two cups, said this one's for you, handed me one. I'm in shock, made my day. I told her afterwards, I mean, this whole thing went viral that he does it. Yeah, he's fun, he's charming, super personable. He does it. Yeah, he's fun, he's charming, super personable in the clubhouse. One inside and it spins Miranda out of there. Jose Miranda on the ground to short Swanson in into his right field and throws out Miranda. Cubs defense has played great for the last two and a half months. Time for Intelligence Center. Power setting a major league record with 67 in a row. Popped up, corner game, and some more makes the catch. And that got a smile. I don't know whether <laughs> Shota must have said something to him. And maybe among all the pitchers. On the ground, Dansby Swanson takes it in. And one, two, three, go the Twins. Three zip midway in the second. Every time he's gone out there. But it doesn't always work that way. And almost 20 under 500. Elise Meneker. Between innings, Tommy Hadovy tells me, though, he's a very simple guy. Like, is the shape good on my pitch? Is what he prepared watching video going into the game? He can make adjustments based on what he's seeing, even doings, and showed it especially during the game. Outside and now in three and two the count. Here it comes and it's fouled away. That said, to make a team or an impression, they mean something. Swing and a miss. Kepler down on strikes and Shota's gotten the first seven that he has faced. And, and I look at Shota 
when you watch his wind up and his finish, he's always looking at home plate. He goes straight towards, and I think that's why he's so good at reading swings and what the hitter's trying to do against. He is really good at keeping his momentum towards home plate. And I think the first two innings in 18 pitches. He seems to be enjoying himself. He's also got a glorious mane of hair. <laughs> Are you sure, umpire? Yeah. Here comes a one-two. That's way too high. Two-two. That's a pretty good take there by Vasquez. With Chase yeah, on that splitter. There. He fin he finished. Be pitch number eight to Vasquez. And again, this is something that we in year two of that three year deal he signed with the Twins. And he chased there, he got him with that splitter. Another strikeout, number four, and Shota has gotten the first eight he's faced. Well, his splitter acts different ways. At times, it will act a little bit like a slider, at times, it will dive down, at times, it has a little bit of lead now. So watch right here. Is the timing the same every time, or is it to feel like his weight is over the rubber so he can explode down the rubber? And I think he gets carried because of now that was much quicker. Lee awaiting a 2 1. Elise, what do you got? Lee, after that, can't. Even Naga, 2 2. Swing and a miss, struck him out. He strikes out the side and Shota. Has retired the first nine that he has faced. Carter Hawkins will join us coming up. They're scoring all the way from first on a single. We're back here, top of the fourth. And the lefty delivers. Cover tries to get the second. I like that as well. But really good on Willie Chill. Swing and a miss. Imanaga gets another. Strikeout number six and ten in a row retired. Time now. Great stocks, options, futures, crypto. Thank you, Phil Cuzzy. Billy tonight, and I was waving my arm trying to get warm up here, and she was like, well, let's have some action. He succeeds around. They're going to have a, a better time with the Santana takes that one for ball four. Yeah, he just misses with this fastball third, the fourth, the fifth. In the air left field, Hack is back, and that one into the basket and gone. Royce Lewis will touch him all. He got enough of it, and got it out of here, and all of a sudden it's a 4-2 game for Lewis, his 14th. So the home run ball has been part of Imanaga's story. The mix more. He's going to have to use his breaking ball more. It's out towards left field, getting knocked down. Swanson is out there, and Dansby makes the catch. Wow. That's a heck of a play. You know, on a night like U.S. women's national team and in the medal match. But what I was saying is it's really hard to be a sweeper. He's got a change up. He's got a cutter. And I think as he gets more. Lined left field, hat coming on, dives and he makes the catch. The Gold Glover steals a hit from Willie Castro. Nice play by Happer. It's 4 2. We head to the bottom of the fourth. And that's obviously here tonight. And he's got a lead. This one popped in the air. Bush foul ground near the wall. And then it spills out of his glove. Just look, a hard look, look play with hands. the wind and got some help. Hit hard. One hopper. Flagged down by Swanson. And Martin retired. No, not to hit it to Dansby Swanson. <laughs> Come on, man. Good point. 
There's Max Kepler. I mentioned last night, Max. That one is in there. Phil Cuzzy rings up Kepler seven strikeouts for Shota. Well, we haven't seen a lot of sweepers from him outside the corner. Down in a way in a perfect pitch. Max, there's not much you can do with that, but foul it off if you're lucky. Big swing from Vasquez. A one to Vasquez. Contacts, he fouls off a lot of the chase pitches and has long at bats. One and two the count. And a swing and a miss, another strikeout. Eight for Shota, beautiful effort and beautiful shots from our Megalodon camera. Four seamer. Swing and a miss right there. And that the four seamer in the zone. About different antennas that go up for a manager. And a lot of times 574 OPS. From 70 off more than usual, telling you that maybe his stuff isn't quite as crisp. That's towards third, but fouled. Yeah, so it's not the swings and how much they're fouling off. Are they taking more pitches that they were swinging at earlier, starting to wreck? Two. Lee waits. And that's drilled out towards right center. Pete Crow Armstrong on the run, and he can't come up with it. So Lee comes up with a double and PCA trying to track that one down. I have an anecdotal. But how the fact that the wall is very I think you're exactly right. And and yeah. swing and a miss Margot chases a splitter strikeout number nine and there's one away. Some cannolis kind of got excited for that. That's the third Paredes. I'll tell you what, I wish be eating a piece of pizza. <laughs> you gotta make him hit your pitch like that. Yeah, and you wonder a little bit. I know that here. Consider this for a second, Joe. The one-two. On the ground. That won't get out. Swanson over to first. Good job by Imanaga pitching around the leadoff double. Right there, Cubs lead it 6 2 at Wrigley. Jose Miranda at the plate. Swings and drives one fast. Just got him. You just hate it. Swing and a miss. Strikeout number 10 for Shota. Manages the Twins, and he manages the Twins. Which which one is harder? Yeah. Well, I think he would say Ali handles most of that. He also has a a dog manager. Well, a manager of these. Twins. Those Twins, I believe, are. And a one two. So Castro has been out there short. That one served out into right center field. Pete Crow Armstrong there to make the catch. And two up, two down. Cubs baseball is presented by the Illinois Lottery. Thank you for 50 amazing years, Illinois. Putting a needle through the toughest piece of hitting your heels with yeah. a hammer. That's what it feels like. That first step out of bed. <laughs> That's the center field. Pete Crow Armstrong there to make the catch. Shota Imanaga outstanding here tonight. Seven innings, two runs, seventh inning stretch. Brought to you by Budweiser. This Bud's for you.